Hello, this is Mark from Boosted CRM, and I'm going to show you how our integration between WooCommerce and Zoho Books, Zoho Inventory, and CRM is going to work. To show you an example, I'm going to start creating a WooCommerce order inside WordPress, which is a plugin because we don't want to use credit card. This is a test. So what I'm going to do... Just quickly create an order for this client. And create a test user, test 600. Or I'll just use the test 600 as last name and first name as Mark. Company boosted CRM, test 600. Let's use an address, use an email address, test 600 at gmail.com. Doesn't matter as long as we have something for the email address and transaction ID. These information will come from the order that you actually place on your website, WooCommerce shopping cart. Then I copy all these for billing information because we're gonna need these for our shipping and packaging later on. And at this point, I add an item, add a product. These products already exist in your WooCommerce. So I just can use anything like a Raptor and a Kodiak. Add them. And also change this one to two and maybe this one to three calculation is done save it items are added to this order and the calculation is done so basically all we need to do at this point if the orders come from WooCommerce this is going to be processing uh, but if it's not if you're creating an order manually I don't know if you do that inside your WooCommerce or directly inside your Zoho inventory. But anyways, it's going to work, the integration that we created. As soon as I create this order, this is going to create an, a contact. If this contact doesn't exist in inventory and books and CRM, it's going to create the contact first and then create an order and add it to it, which is a sales order. If the contact exists, it's going to just search for it and only add the or new order to the existing contact as a sales order. So let's create. We have to take a look inside Zoho Books right after this to see if this test 600 has been created. Now, if I refresh this page on contacts, Zoho Books, I can see that this test 600 is created. Also, a, per, a sales order has been created probably, yeah, right here. This sales order, if I click on it, you will see that these Raptors and Kodiak items have, to, have been added as a sales order. So here you can do create, convert this to an invoice or purchase order or whatever you want to do. At the same time, if you want to create any shipping or packaging for these items you need to go to zoho inventory and once you look at the zoho sell sales orders inside zoho inventory let me refresh this page it's automatically sync as you can see this customer needs boosted crm test 600 sales order is right here it's as a draft so at this point you can create a package create a shipment create an invoice out of it and you can change the status or create a purchase order out of it. The synchronization between the books, the inventory, and CRM is done. So now if I go to the CRM and refresh the contacts, I can see Mark Test 600 created as a contact name. And the account is also created. And now if I go to this person, contact, and go down to Zoho Books, related, related lists, I can see this sales order inside the CRM. So you don't even need to go to the books and inventory to see 
sales orders. You just click on it and it will show you the sales order. Also, if you have any estimates or invoice, it will be available inside uh, Zoho Books tab under the main menu, inside on the main menu. So basically, as you can see, this integration syncs, first of all, integrates between WooCommerce and Zoho Books, inventory and CRM, and syncs all the data together. Thank you.